So I realized it's been a little minute since I've played piano in the vlog. So today we're gonna start off with a little song. It's actually been a little, a little minute since I played the piano at all. So bear with me, please. <laughs> Hey guys, kickboxing really makes me feel out of shape, but what's up guys? It's Meg. Welcome back to another vlog. Out of breath. I went to kickboxing class the other day and jujitsu. And in kickboxing we learned the question mark kick and I've been sort of obsessed with it since. So I'm not very good at it, but it's like you fake what's called a teep, which is basically just like a, it looks like a front kick if you're familiar with karate, but um, uh, sorry I'm out of breath, but um, a teep, unlike a front kick, it's like you're just pushing them away. You're not like, you're not snapping. Okay, so it's not like, it's not like that. You're not snapping your leg, um, you're pushing. So it's like, sort of like a jab, but with your foot, just push. So a uh, question mark kick is like, you go to fake a teep, and instead, roundhouse kick. Not very good at it yet, but it's been really fun. All right, now that I'm all sweaty, it's time to get to work. So today, it's pretty miserable outside today. Um, we're probably gonna be in my house all day. Is this a bit extra for a vlog? I have these two lights set up and shining on me. Um, I don't know. I love them. I'm obsessed with these lights. So this is the last thing I ordered for the product photography studio, guys, and who would have guessed it, but I'm having second thoughts about whether or not, like, I really want to do product photography. I know, right? Like, who would have, who would have thought I would change my mind after buying a bunch of equipment? I'm having second thoughts because, like, if you think about it, it's sort of the opposite of real estate photography and of what I liked about real estate photography. Like real estate photography, it's so straightforward. So this is the paper and just like I thought, it doesn't come with something to hang it on. I'm just thinking like, do I want to specialize in a certain type of photography or do I want to be someone that does like all around, like all types of photography and branch out into every little subcategory? Or do I want to focus in on real estate and Ariel specifically. I mean, don't get me wrong. I did have fun doing the product photo shoots that I did in the past few vlogs. Um, but like overall, I more so enjoy like run and gun type shooting. Like I don't really enjoy having to set up, having to like create some elaborate set. All right, so it's now 1 p.m. Got some goldfish, some snacks. Uh, I was just like trying to finish signing up for uh, a platform called drone base which is basically you can find freelance drone gigs i'm going to spend the next hour to two hours or so doing some cold calls i'm gonna do it a bit differently i'm going on to zillow and i'm going to look for like individual listings that need drone photography specifically so for example i just found this one house here they have absolutely beautiful photography but i don't see any drone photos so um, I made up like a separate little script for this. And I'm also gonna do an impromptu Q&A. So maybe I'll do like a cold call, a question. A cold call, a question. Oh, that's gotta be good luck. First, Jeff, how do I help services Benjamin Real Estate? Hi, um, is Ben there? Um, he's not right now. Can I take a message? I'm calling about the... 90 MPA listing. My name's Meg and I'm a real estate 
photographer and videographer, um, I noticed that they didn't have any drone photos for this property, and I was just wondering if that's something that Ben might be interested in. Oh, okay. Um, I can let him know. Now let's do the first question. I'm just going to answer this question because it's the first comment that comes up, and I get this question a lot. Hockey Talkie said, where do you get your music for videos? I want to start getting into making simple hiking videos for myself, and I want to use music that isn't copyright claimed. Are you able to use popular, well-known songs in your videos, or will you automatically get a strike? Okay, so I don't really try to use uh, popular songs anymore. I get all my music from Epidemic Sound. Right now, I have the $15 a month plan, which if you or anyone, if anyone is interested in signing up to Epidemic Sound to use their music for their YouTube videos, please sign up with a link in the description of this video because it is my affiliate link and um, you get one month free and I get one month free. Please use my link if you're gonna sign up. I'd appreciate it and it would help out the channel. Ooh. Someone has a lot of land in Fogelsville, PA, and they don't have any aerial. Please leave a message and I'll be sure to get back to you. Hi, Brian. Hope you're doing well today. My name's Meg and I'm a real estate photographer and videographer. I noticed you don't have any drone photos of your property and I was just wondering if that's something that you might be interested in. All right, next question. This is kind of fun, going back and forth between the calling and the questioning. Travis Schwartz said, how many DoorDash deliveries you make? I am at 800. Damn, that's a lot. Let me check. I've done 199. Hello. Hi, is this Anita? Yeah, who's this? Uh, my name's Meg, I'm a real estate photographer. I saw your listing and I was just wondering if you would be interested in having professional photos taken. It's just land, Megan. Would you be interested in like drone photography? I do have, I actually do have someone um, that I use for drone photography. His dad works with me. Okay, thank you. <laughs> I think she just went, it's just land, Megan. <laughs> It's just land, Megan. So on my last weekend in my life vlog, Brayden Deans commented, great video, Meg. A question occurred while watching. How do you determine what the turnaround time will be for the media for clients? That's a good question. I should probably come up with like a set amount of time or like an estimated amount of time and tell them. But for that last project and for also for the free real estate photography gig that I did a few months ago back in December, um, I just tried to get it done as as fast, as quickly as possible. Hi, this is Steve. Hi, how are you doing today, Steven? I'm good, how are you doing? Pretty good, thank you. And I noticed you have some really nice photos for this property, but um, I was wondering if you'd be, also be interested in uh, like some drone photography? Oh, um, no, not for this one, not this time. Um, but maybe for other listings possibly so this next question uh is from a video a couple weeks ago not the last weekend in my life vlog but the weekend in my life vlog before that jessica irene asked and i did read your question before i've been wanting to answer it but i've just been thinking of like my answer so uh jessica said this may come across a little forward but i was wondering what your type is because in this weekend in my life vlog i had gone on a date in philly and then she continues because i live in philly too lol but i'm really curious about what your type of person is are you a shallow person do you care about looks more than personality what are you looking for in a partner? Please don't take offense to these questions. I hope you don't think I'm being nosy or creepy because I'm just curious if I creeped you out. <laughs> then just ignore this embarrassing post for me. LOL. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to ignore your post. I don't think I would consider myself an extremely shallow person. I mean, maybe. I do care about looks, but I would say um, I care more about personality and my type that's a good question my type is usually people that don't want anything to do with me just kidding <laughs> i would say my type is more girls that dress and present themselves in a more uh mask way i don't know if any of my audience is going to be familiar with like uh lgbt like terms but what are you looking for in a partner see i don't really know if i'm looking for a partner right now all right it's 2 p.m now i was gonna do another call right away but i think i'm actually gonna take a lunch break because i just ran out of goldfish and i'm hungry
right, it's been a little minute since the last update. Um, I'm here in my mom's car, vroom vroom. Um, decided to go to the gym today instead of kickboxing and jujitsu class. Let's see what she has to say. Vroom vroom. I don't want to be in it. You don't want to be in it. Well, I All right guys, as you can see, I'm back home now with my dogs and it was a pretty good workout. Um, I'm gonna end this video here because I really wanna start editing as soon as possible. Thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment down below, hit the subscribe button if you're not already and hit the bell so that you're notified when the next video drops. And until then, Willie and Summer and me, we'll see you guys in the next video on Monday. Bye. <laughs>